I've been baking again. Uh, it's been a while since I made a cake. I love making cakes, but there was so much yard work I had to pay attention to uh, mowing and weeding and planting, etc. Anyway, as you can see, I already took a piece out of it. Look how tiny the piece is that I took. Instead of it being one eighth of the cake, it's one one sixteenth of the cake. Am I think? Am I adding? <laughs> Never mind. Anyway, I wanted to uh, put the recipe below. Lots of healthy ingredients. Uh, the reason it's dark. It's not chocolate. I don't like to use cocoa because it has caffeine in it, and caffeine is a drug. This is carob flat flour. It's a plant. It's very powdery. It has a very similar to cocoa taste. And it's healthy. There's no caffeine in it, and there's nutrients in it. Um, I couldn't decide which extract to use, so I thought I'll just use up the one already open, which is rum extract. But I did buy some bulk boxes of my favorite extract, which is maple. Now, uh, here's the, uh, the carob did not come in this container, as you can see. It came in this bag. And it's hard to find in person, so I buy it online. You might think that are these special, exciting ingredients more expensive? Yes, but if you eat the proper amounts, less, less than the normal serving that people usually eat, then it's worth it. Plus, uh, you save trips to the doctor with your co-payments if you eat healthy food. Uh, this recipe, I put some coconut flakes in it, also something I buy online. It has no sugar in it. I don't like sugar because it's so concentrated. It can raise and, and lower your blood glucose uh, very quickly. And then we get symptoms, and then we don't feel good, and et cetera, et cetera. So I, I see online that people are cooking more because they're home. That's a good thing. Food cooked at home tastes so much better than restaurant food and, and ref uh, highly processed food. So uh, that's about it. Uh, when, I'm, when I'm calculating the ingredients, uh, this happens to be a double recipe. So if I just want a uh, quick uh, small cake, like, you know, just for two meals, then I would cut my recipe in half or a normal recipe I wanted a few days the uh, regular size but this one I doubled because I'd like to freeze the pieces so look for the recipe below any questions ask me I hope you're continuing during these times to be very active you could be active out in your garden in the neighborhood or in the house and um, I've started, I'm trying to get back to all my perfect habits. Sometimes I slip away from them. So I'm not eating at night and I'm going to bed like, you know, within a half hour after sunset. I read the news for a while on my phone and get sleepy and then go to sleep. And then I wake up way before sunrise, which gives you a really great start to the day. Um, especially me, I want to exercise, I want to do some studying. And I want to be dressed and ready to go. I mean, I could uh, take a dog walk maybe at 7 a.m. Um, it's nice and cool that part of the day anyway. Okay, that's about it.